What's up, Tyler Casey here, and if you're like me, you probably just updated Adobe Premiere 2019. It's the newest version of Adobe. It has a lot of great features. I'm not making a video about that today. Uh, I made this video last year, and I figured it'd be helpful anyone searching this up. So it's real simple. If you lost your LUTs, if you updated and you don't have any of the LUTs that you installed, I'm going to show you how to go in and get your LUTs. Uh, this should work about the same on Mac, so just follow along and kind of look in the similar places. So when you go to creative, color, all your LUTs aren't going to be there. You're just going to have the ones that come with Premiere. So if you purchase any, I'm going to show you how to grab them real quick. Just go into your C drive where your programs are. Go to Program Files. Then we're going to go to Adobe. Then you're going to see Adobe Premiere 2018. And then 19 is going to have this little folder icon. It's pretty cool. They changed it for this year. Um, and then I just have Lumetri in here. Go to Lumetri. Uh, all my other stuff got deleted because I uninstalled it. But Lumetri will be right there. Go to LUTs, Creative, and then all your old LUTs are going to be in here. Um, if you didn't uninstall 2018 yet and you didn't delete your uh, preferences, all the folders are still going to be in there. So just go through. Go to right here. You can see Lumetri, LUTs, Creative. Then we're going to hit Control A or Command A, Control C, copy them all. Then back to Adobe. In then we're going to go into 2019, go to Lumetri right here. Where'd it go? And then we're going to go to LUTs, Creative, same thing. Right click, paste it in there, and then just click Continue, click Yes. And then you could skip all the duplicates. And then also what I would suggest as well, because if you ever use Media Encoder, you're definitely going to want to have your LUTs in there as well, because you're going to notice if you color grade your footage and then put it in Media Encoder, it's not going to have the same look to it. So make sure you do this as well. So you're in Adobe, you're going to see Media Encoder right there, 2019. Same thing. We're going to go to Lumetri. We're going to go to LUTs, Creative, and we're going to paste all those in. And as you can see, I haven't done this yet, so it's going through. Whoops. And I'm going to click continue. Sorry about that. And it's just going to keep adding them all. If you guys want to see the changes, make sure you just restart your program, close out of it, open it again. So I'm going to open Premiere 2019 again. You see I got the new logo rocking. Let me know if you guys below have updated yet and if you guys have seen any cool features that you guys like. It looked like the graphics were a lot better and they added a little bit more to the Lumetri, which looks dope. Hopefully I'll maybe do another video on that, but this is what we're working on today. Here we are. And now when we go to color, all of our LUTs are in here. So that worked out super good. If you found this video helpful, make sure to comment below and let everyone else know. If this is your first time seeing my channel, I have a bunch of other videos on here. I have a podcast where I talk with other creatives and I break down a lot of music videos I shoot. So make sure to check those out. I'm going to link those at the end. Thank you for watching. I'm Tyler Casey and I'll catch you guys next time. Thanks.